Content is organized under the tabs to the right of the Audit Trail tab. All of the items that can be searched for and used in an estimate contain material pricing from Trade Service and the labor data is from Trimble. The Favorites tab contains the favorites list of items that were created by the user in the My Content area. Here you will see your favorite lists, and when you select a list, all of the items in that list will be displayed. From here, you can just select an item and then press the takeoff button to start the takeoff process. The Assemblies tab contains the Trimble curated assemblies and the customer defined assemblies that are built in Workbench. From the Trimble assemblies, you can search the Trimble assemblies that are provided with Estimation MEP via the drill down or the keyword search. After you've found the assembly that you're looking for, you can just select it and then hit the takeoff button to start the takeoff process. Under the assembly library option, you can do a similar search of the user-defined assemblies that have been created in Workbench and then add that to your estimate. The library tab contains trade service individual items that can be added to an estimate. The customer defined items that are built in the item library are available for use in all estimates are also found here. Under, under trade service, you can search for items via the drill downs or by entering a keyword search into the text box. Again, when you drill down far enough, you just select the item that you're looking for and then hit the takeoff button. Alternatively, you can search by text also for items in trade service by doing a text search here. You can also select from the item library option to search for user defined items. From here, you can just select an item from the folder and list structure and then find that item and then select that for takeoff. The custom items tab is where job specific items that were created by the user are stored. You can create new custom items here and they will just be added to the list. You can also select an item from this list and hit the takeoff button to start the takeoff process with that item. Previously, I mentioned the favorites and the item library. Both of these sources are accessed via the My Content link down here in the lower left-hand corner. With the item library, you can create user-defined items and organize them into folders and lists. These user-defined items in the item library can be used across all of your estimates. With the favorites list option, you can create lists that contain items from the trade service and the item library. You can also add assemblies into your favorite lists. Think of favorites list as a shortcut to items that you use frequently, and this gives you a faster way of finding them during takeoff. 